tire out the dog swimming. Morning swim. I think it makes him the most tired out of any activity. Just like me? Yeah. It's like cold and hard, but he won't stop. Can't stop. Can't stop. Good boy. That was far. That was a far one. All right, hope you enjoyed that. Um, that was a little bit of footage from Paula's birthday. We went to the same place we did last year and just kind of unplugged a little bit. Um, this video is going to be a little bit different, I think. I want to just kind of capture some stuff as I see it and be make it as beautiful as possible. Um, and I don't think we'll get that much into training. It'll probably also be coming out like a couple days after I do Escape from Alcatraz. Uh, just guessing that's how long it'll take me to get it done. But yeah, less training, more just vibes of being outside. Uh, next thing, we're headed to the pool. We got some friends in town, gonna be here for the summer and uh, do some pool stuff. <laughs> You guys liking Ben so far? Love it. As uh, Ellie's been on Zillow looking at our property. <laughs> so many people are like, get Ellie on the pod, get Ellie on the pod. <laughs> and we're gonna have to make that happen for sure. Oh yeah. yeah so beautiful here. Yeah. We feel lucky. We are very lucky. All right, this audio is gonna sound terrible, but that's okay. Um, today I've got some new camera stuff that I'm working with, trying to just level up like the overall, I guess professionalism look of the footage. It's got nothing to do with storytelling, just something that sounds fun to me. And I'm just trying out some new setups to see um, how efficient I can be with different, slightly different configurations of a camera. I'll put a video of what I'm holding on to right now. It's very heavy, so I'm gonna put it down quick. Uh, this morning, I already did my hard bike workout. Paula did a swim, 
and now she set out to do her hard bike workout and I'm just gonna chase her around on the moped with all of my uh, with all my stuff. She's doing six by four minutes. She's getting ready for the Canadian TT Championships. Uh, so doing she's doing Skyliner. Made a lot of Skyliner videos, but uh, still pretty up there. See if I can go one better than last time. What's up, baby? Yeah. How'd it go? Mm, it, was, it was the same thing as every other time we've done this. This is the fourth time we've done this. It's a lot. You look good when I saw you. Yeah, I held 310 for... 310, 310, 311, 312, 313, 314. By six by four minutes. But... I didn't feel, I, I did not feel good. You did not? It's impossible to feel good on that. Yeah. Because if you feel good, you're not going hard enough. The point is that you want it to end immediately. Then you're going hard enough. <coughs> okay. Yeah, it's good TT practice. It's good TT practice. There's a little downhill on it, so. I don't know. Sweet. I, I, I don't know if I got any good footage of you, but I tried really hard. It's, yeah, I will show you. You'll get a viewing. Now can we play ball, please? You finally play ball. All right, I hope that was fun. Um, or pretty, or something. Um, sometimes I just feel like I just want to make some beautiful stuff and not necessarily talk to the camera that much and show workouts or anything after all when we started ttl it was uh it wasn't so much about training COVID immediately hit and i don't know my favorite thing to do is just like show off places that we go and uh try to make it pretty so i most likely will not be doing a video about alcatraz uh nick ended up having to go to a wedding paula is is not able to come I think I'm just gonna be going down, getting this one done on my own. Uh, maybe take some pictures. I don't know what I'll do, but it's not gonna be a bunch of race footage. So, anyway, um, last thing that we're gonna do here. This is something that is extremely special, and I will talk to the camera for a second about it. Uh, these hoodies that we made with Ralph Dunning at Foreign Rider. Uh, these have been in the works for well over a year now, and it's been something that I've been wanting to do with Ralph. Uh, since we made TTL early 2020 so these hoodies are 
absolutely incredible. Uh, since I got this sample, I have been wearing it nonstop. Paula has been wearing it. I'm a size two, she's a size one. Uh, they're technically unisex, but she looks real good in it. They're made in Canada. They're not cheap to make, so they're a little more expensive than jackets that we've had in the past. They will be shipping from Canada, so if you're in Canada, this is your opportunity to get a DTL thing with very low shipping costs. Anyway, we've got 100 of them. They feel incredible, they look incredible. We'd love it if you represented, so that's it. We're headed out to just get some real cool shots of them. Thanks for watching. Feel good, and you know I can't complain. Cause my baby just called, she said she's on her way. And now she's walking up the drive, got the record player wrong. She's stepping up inside, it's a favorite song. She kicked her right shoe off, her left shoe off She's dropping down her shoulders and she's moving all around She put her right hand down, her left hand down She put them on her hips and she blew a little kiss and I said Oh my, my, didn't know my baby move like this Oh my, my, didn't know my baby move like this